Bluey is one of the best shows out there, but we still manage to find some small mistakes in some of its episodes. One of them happens in the episode Magic Feather Wand, where Bingo is playing with magical powers using a feather that makes things super heavy. And then she does it with her dad's famous yoga ball. Seriously, look at her having so much fun. Hold on, look again. Her snout moves, but her head turns a bit later, creating this weird and funny animation image at the same time. Hey! Ah, look out! Hardly anyone noticed this little mistake when they watched this episode for the first time, so we knew you'd enjoy seeing it. <laughs> we put together 12 Bluey errors just for you today. Superpower Some might argue that what we mentioned in the introduction is not a mistake, but one of Bingo's superpowers. And it's not the only one. In the episode, we see another supposed superpower of Bluey's younger sister. In the episode Asparagus, when she and Jilly pretend to be wild animals preparing to attack Pat, Lucky's dad, we see another error. I mean, Bingo's superpower. Watch with me. When they attack Pat, you can see that for a brief moment, Bingo's left paw passes through Lucky's dad's leg in a ghostly style. <laughs> but since we know she doesn't have superpowers and certainly isn't a little ghost, it's actually just a minor editing error in this super funny episode. Oh, Mrs. Hella. Oh, I don't know about this. Oh. Oh. Funny. Color, yes. Color, no. Mackenzie is one of Bluey's friends and, according to many fans of the show, a potential future boyfriend for the protagonist. But only time will tell. <laughs> and on the episode The Creek, something interesting happens with the character. But before I reveal it, take a look at Mackenzie's appearance. He has black and white fur and his two hind legs have different colors, with the left one having more black fur and the right one having more white fur. But in the episode, something funny occurs. Near the end, as they return from their trip to the creek, everyone is dirty but happy. But hold on, look at Mackenzie's legs. They were both normal in one scene, but suddenly they both turned white in the next scene. And no, it has nothing to do with the mud on his feet. It's just a small animation error. Hey, look, gang, you got the swings all to yourself. Do you want one last go before we head home? Two-Faced. In the episode Magic Xylophone, we see the Healer family doing what they do best, having fun together. We see the girls of the family playing with hand-drawn characters. Notice that the characters Bluey and Bingo are drawn with smiles, meaning their mouths are turned upwards, while Chili, the girl's mother, has a downward-facing mouth. But as the game progresses, we see that at a certain moment when Bandit also joins in the fun, Bluey's hand-drawn character suddenly has an inverted smile. She might have erased the previous smile and drawn a new one, but we didn't see that happening in the episode, so it's marked as a small mistake. Floating Nose In the episode Takeaway, we can notice a small animation error in this beloved show. When Bluey is playing with Bingo, pretending to work at a restaurant and take her customer's order, if you pause the scene at the right moment, you'll see this. Notice that the tip of Bluey's snout moved faster than the rest of her face, and the dark blue ball seemed to be hovering in the air. <laughs> is this a healer family magic trick? I don't think so this time. So, man, what would you like? I'm just gonna check on the spring rolls. I'll have some super spicy, please. Free Spots In the episode Zoo, one of the most fun episodes of all, when we watched it for the tenth time, don't judge, we noticed a small editing error that I believe no one noticed the first time they watched the episode. But first, let me say this. If you think about it, you'll remember that Chili's fur on her head has a light shade on the left side with a darker brown spot on her right eye. And in between her eyes, there's a very light beige spot, right? But in the episode, when Chili realizes that Bingo has entered the imaginary monkey cage, which is actually Bandit, we see that she gets so desperate that even the spots on her head change color. You can see that the lighter spot between her eyes disappears, and in its place is the dominant color of Chili's fur, which is kind of orangish. This was a subtle error, but we noticed it. Snowdrop! That gorilla has snowdrop! Snowdrop on monkey! Uppercase and lowercase. At the beginning of the series, Bluey and Bingo shared the same room, with each of the sisters having their own bed. One detail that always caught our attention on their beds is that each one has the letter B carved on the back, as it's the first letter of each of the two girls' names. On Bluey's bed, the B is uppercase, as she's the older sister, and on Bingo's bed, the B was always lowercase, even when they slept in separate rooms. And you can see the difference. But in the episode, Weekend, something very curious happens. When the parents put the girls to bed, right at the end of the episode, we see that the B on Bingo's bed magically changes from a lowercase b to an uppercase b, just like her older sister's bed. I doubt you noticed this when you watched the episode. Smelling with the neck. 
Remember the power, in quotes, that we mentioned the Healer family has in being able to move their heads and snouts at different times? Well, it seems that it's not limited to Bandit's daughters. It also exists in the Stripe family, Bluey's uncle. In the episode Barbecue, we see that Sox, their little cousin, can also do something similar. When Bingo accidentally sprays water everywhere by opening the hose too wide, everyone rushes to see the funny situation. But if you look closely at Sox, you'll notice that when he's running to see the scene, look what happens to his snout. Literally, the little puppy's head is turned in one direction while his snout is turned in the other. And that's not all. When he gets closer to the porch, we can see his snout, which was just slightly turned outward as if it was completely at the back of Sox's head. This error is probably the spookiest one in Bluey so far. <laughs> Living Eye One of the most beloved episodes of Bluey is Barnicus and Bumpy, where the family and their friends make a kind of movie for Bingo while she's in the hospital for some unknown reason. The amateur film unfolds throughout the episode, and in the end, all the Hollywood superstars involved in the film do the typical thank you that actors do at the end of a play for their audience, and that's when something very strange happens. Muffin, the girl's cousin who participates in the play, is wearing a chef's hat because that was her role in the film. In the final scene, we see that the hat falls slightly over her eyes because it's too big, but if you pause at the right moment, you'll see that one of her eyes is covered by the hat, and the other is above it. Wow, that's very strange. <laughs> the end. See you Fading Star One of the episodes that definitely made me feel sorry for Bandit is the one where, as a good father, he tries to make a duck-shaped cake, but he fails miserably. <laughs> But the error isn't there. When Bandit suggests to Bluey that he will give her Golden Star stickers for each toy she saves, which is a good deal, notice that the sticker sheet is complete. And when he arrives in the kitchen right after, the sheet has one less star. So far, we can't say it's a mistake, since he could have put a sticker on the way from the living room to the kitchen at some point, but then, when he returns to the living room to talk to Bluey and is holding the bowl where he's making the cake batter, we see him holding the sticker sheet again, and it's complete once more. Now we can definitely confirm that our suspicion came true. It's a continuity continuity error in this part of the episode. Well played, Bluey. Double Frame Bluey's family has many paintings and photos of memorable moments spread throughout their home, which is pretty cool. But at some moments, it seems like these frames move around. Want to see? In the episode Hotel, the girls put up signs on the doors indicating that each number corresponds to a different room in the hotel. And when Bluey is showing the options to the guest, Bandit, we see that between room number one and number two, we see the famous photo of Bandit and Chili from their camping trip where he probably proposed to her. And when they reach room six, which is actually the bathroom, look at the frame right next to it. It's the exact same frame. We caught that one too. In the episode Burger Shop, we see Bandit trying to convince the girls to leave the bathtub, but they end up convincing him to join and play with them a little longer. When Chili threatens to get into the tub to remove everything from it, something curious happens. Bandit's head changes color. As everyone knows, he is blue, just like Bluey, who takes after him. But both of them have a slightly darker shade of blue on their heads, and Bandit's head is entirely blue. But if you pause the scene at the right moment, you'll see that his head quickly changes from half dark to half light blue. We got this one quickly. Folks, it's great to make videos about Bluey, even if it's to showcase the 12 mistakes we found in the show. And these two videos that are popping up for you now were also a lot of fun to create, so we've separated them for you to enjoy. Just pick one and click on it. Have a blast!